guys and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing very well. I have a very exciting vlog for you guys today. I actually travelled to Malta with Party Hard Travel and I had the most incredible time. It was actually my first party holiday. I'm keeping the intro quick and snappy because this is a hefty vlog, let me tell you that. If you guys do enjoy this video, please smash a massive thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And yeah, I just wanted to say a massive thank you to Party Hard for this amazing trip. You guys are going to love this video. And if any of you guys are looking for a party events package for your holiday this year, definitely check out Party Hard and enjoy this video. <laughs> spoken to you in a little while but basically we landed pretty late last night because of all the delays and we didn't get back to the hotel until like nearly three o'clock and then i was absolutely shattered so i just kind of just got in bed and went to sleep but we have arrived at the hotel it's absolutely lovely and it's actually really sunny and really warm today so i've just popped on a bikini i popped on this like little one from boohoo and some shorts and me and anna are gonna go and head out and look for a shop just so we can get a few little things and then we're gonna try and sunbathe for a little bit and then we have um i think it's called champagne champagne sessions this afternoon which i'm super excited about but i need to pick out an outfit so i'm not too sure yet but i've just thought i'd update you guys honestly the whole airport situation was a nightmare first we were like we couldn't check in because my name wasn't right on the ticket then we actually managed to get through security but security was like confused as to which gate of security was open no one was like communicating with one another stayed in terminal three for quite a while and then they called our flight queued up for the flight waited a whole hour for the flight we didn't set off till like nearly an hour later obviously then landed in malta an hour later so that was kind of stressful but yeah we're here now and i'm super excited to get started with the holiday hopefully i have lots of fun vlog footage for you guys and yeah i'll see you guys later hey everyone so awfully massive switch from the last time i saw you basically was in a rush to get ready so if you've been watching for a while now, you'll just know that's how things go around here. We're now heading to a, I actually don't know what it is. It's like a party. And I've got on like this lovely bikini thing. It's not a bikini, it's a swimsuit from PLT. I feel like I look a little bit summery. Trying to decide whether to wear wedges or Crocs. Not sure. But anyway, um, thought I'd give you a little rundown before I just switch to a random clip of me on a coach with loads of other people. But I'll see you guys when we get there. I'm actually terrified to take my camera because I'm going to be drinking, but we move. for a lovely meal and then I think we're going to the beach club that we went to yesterday I don't know how many clips I got yesterday of the beach club but I'll definitely get a few more today because I'm going to be taking my camera um, but basically I'm a little bit sad because Jazz, Sophie, Haz, Callum 
all of them guys are leaving tomorrow and honestly I don't feel like I've had any time with them whatsoever we only really had last night and tonight but there are a few people staying and I'm excited for the rest of my trip but yeah I'm heading out now and I'm just wearing this like sorry the room is an absolute disgrace that's a little bit embarrassing but i'm gonna head upstairs now because my converse are actually in anna's room and i need them back because i want to wear them tonight oh. <laughs> don't show my sunburn off her it's so embarrassing <laughs> Christmas I did like Santa <laughs> <laughs> So that I look mint But every season like Halloween I would do pumpkin <laughs> like, It was mint honestly Too what? short for me What was? Was the word boo too short for me? <laughs> well I quite like pumpkin I was very like original <laughs> Original Bye my lover Bye <laughs> Guys, we're going on a boat party, but we're late as per usual. Shock. Look! Anna is wearing full Ellie. <laughs> We're on the boat and we're sat on like this net thing. There were some fish down there, but they've gone now. We don't have any sun cream, any tanning oil. We completely forgot to put it on. So we're probably going to look like lobsters. Oh my! I feel like I'm on the Titanic. Wait, I feel like I'm wrong. This would be a good idea. I'm wearing wedges. The oh my god, the floor is literal volcanic rock. I look like Willy Wonka. Massive. I've got two knives, you've got two forks. Sam's in a fork for this. Okay. Daddy killed John. He was like, I've got I've got no meat left. But yet there was like 13 pieces of lamb in the thing. I was like, you're joking. Guys, apparently this is the set from the original Popeye the Sailor Man film, as the guy has just told us, but I'm not too sure and it's so cute though. Kind of looks like a what did we just say? Like, like a Indiana Jones, like a Indiana Jones theme park. Yeah, that's what I thought. So we're back on the camera now. I literally took my camera out to vlog probably the best day of the trip, and it died. So I don't know how many, how much footage I got, and I don't know how interesting this vlog is going to be but it is how what time is it now 10 to 11 and we're on monday um i was meant to be going out tonight everyone's gone out to a sushi restaurant literally <laughs> everyone in the hotel's gone out to a sushi restaurant together and they're having drinks after they're going to the club i was meant to go but i had the worst anxiety attack ever and ended up just not feeling well so I stayed in. I feel really bad because I really wanted to go out and have fun with everyone. And obviously I'm super grateful that I've been brought on this trip. And I want to experience all the opportunities and everything. But I just, 
having the worst anxiety moment right now. I just feel a little ill as well. I think the food that we had on the um, boat party has made me feel a little bit ill. Um, so I haven't even been able to have any tea because I literally threw up. Um, so instead of my tea, I had a bag of Chili Heatwave Doritos. And then the best thing about this hotel, there's many plus sides to this hotel, but the best thing about this hotel is their hot chocolates. They're so nice. On a morning at breakfast, I will have a hot chocolate because they're the best things ever. Um, so yeah, the lovely man at reception at Bora Bora Hotel in Malta made me a hot chocolate and I'm just so happy to be in bed to be honest I've honestly it's been such a long day like obviously I had to be honest with you because you're gonna be like why are you staying in literally every night I'm gonna have my hot chocolate I'm gonna watch something on Netflix and I'm gonna go to bed good morning everyone <laughs> Oh my gosh, I am so tired. I feel like that's the longest I've had this whole trip as well. I think I slept like a full on 10 hours. I feel so tired, my throat's hurting. Everything's just aching, like my head, I've got a headache. But I have burnt my head a little bit. Don't think anyone's awake yet, so I might get my bikini on and just go and sunbathe for a little bit, but. Oh dear. Right, I'm gonna get my bikini on, go downstairs and sunbathe, so I'll see you guys down at the pool. Hey everyone, I am ready to go down to the beach. I think we're getting coaches here from 12. I've put on like this chainmail top that's pink. I got it from Soriel in Meadowall. Me got it from Soriel in Meadowall. Absolutely love it. And then I've just got on my like white joggers kind of thing. Just want to be comfy today in a white bikini. It's actually really warm today, so I've not put any makeup on because I want to get a bit of a tan on my face. So yeah, I'm excited to see what the beach is like. <laughs> Oh, that actually feels well cute out there. You're in the fat of the land. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me when. <laughs> now. <laughs> How are we feeling about the beach, guys? <laughs> Did you hear me say it smells like pee? <laughs> I went, it smells like pee. Um, I'm actually excited. Beach tan is different. I'm you. I don't want to tan. <laughs> oh. That's bugs. what I mean. I'm like, tan me. I don't care. <laughs> Different. The water looks so clear. I might get in the water. Oh, I've got a headlight. I actually mm. could do it like so I can see you Oh, shall we? Yeah. Oh, I want a Lila. everyone oh i don't know if you guys can see this it's not focused why are you not focused okay everyone we're at the beach oh, it's it. honestly it. so warm yeah, yeah, and it's such a lovely beach absolutely <laughs> love it we're gonna go down now we're just having some photos but yeah love it i want an ice cream rep <laughs> on the way down i'm pretty sure there was one <laughs> thanks rep you're welcome <laughs> there, i guess <laughs> guess yes. okay we're just sunbathing for a little bit but i think we're gonna do one of the like one, say it. Pedalours, isn't it? Pedalours. 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 With the slide, with the slide on. on. We've just come up for some food. I've gone for the cheeser, 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 the chicken <laughs> cheeser, tortilla, and I actually was gonna go for the parma ham like baguette, but I've gone for a sex on the beach as well. And these ladies have gone for a margarita, margarita. and a pina colada. Guys, I'm gonna try the chicken Caesar. I'm actually. Mm, that is actually so nice. It's so nice. All of these guys are going on a what do we call it? A dinghy. A dinghy. They're all going on a dinghy. I'm the designated mum for the day, and then these guys are going out there. <laughs> Me and Jodie are on the boat. They're all on that thing. There's eight of them. And me and Jodie are just having a lovely like. Please chuck them off it. Fly them off it. <laughs> it's actually packed. There's so many of them on there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this is so good. Okay, 
everyone i'm back at the hotel now i'm a little bit sunburnt but not massively i actually thought i'd tan a little bit better but i've just ordered some food and i'm on facetime oh i'm on facetime with lee because i miss him and i won't get to see him until tomorrow which seems like a really long time because i'm not seeing him in ages so i've just ordered some food i think all of them guys have gone for tattoos i'm not too sure but luke has just messaged me saying um we're all at the tattoo shop if you want to meet us but i am not going for a tattoo so i'm staying in i'm gonna wash my hair get some food get ready because we're all going out tonight and then we're going home tomorrow so i'll see you guys when i'm hopefully looking a little bit better than this and we're heading out guys my food's just arrived and it looks so good i didn't actually order this but it's a nice surprise not too sure what it is i think it's sweet potato fries and pesto oh my god best hot chocolate ever i think i told you guys about it last night best hot chocolate ever and um, so i had to get hot chocolate they've given me a little biscuit as well and then i got burger and some cheesy fries i'm absolutely vibing with this this is like <laughs> this is my life in a picture there is the cutest guy that works here and i think he's training and he delivered my food for me and he is just so sweet like he's just really sweet like i love nice like people <laughs> i like nice people and i'm gonna dive into this right now I honestly so much food but i'm gonna eat all of this now and then start getting ready or maybe i'll have a nap i'm not too sure but i'll see you guys later okay everyone i'm all ready to go out honestly Oh, you can see my nipple covers. That is not fun. Cheers. I just cheese my hand rather than the shot. Cheers. Whose is that? Sean, eh? Yeah. I had it. I had it. I had it. Woo! Yes! No songs on. It's like, who's the best one? No, it's not the shot. Last day today, I'm going home at two. Oh, I've just ordered a big McDonald's. I'm absolutely starving. I'm not gonna lie, I've only eaten in this hotel like three times. Um, I don't feel like I've eaten much on this trip at all, but we move. Um, so yeah, I'm just updating you all. Dude, I've seen your hair. I know. <laughs> that whole clip you just had. <laughs> okay, everyone, I am all packed.
packed, ready to go. I've done like a little tidy of the room because I wanted to show you guys what the room looked like. Um, because obviously I didn't show you when I got here. But basically, just a bit of a twin room. Um, I slept in this bed here. And yeah. So, <sighs> do you know what guys? I'm so tired. I'm so ready for home. I've lost my train of thought. Um, and then we got a safe and like a little wardrobe space. That's the balcony, but it's really not a great view. It's just onto the street. Little desk. Oh, I keep going in and out of focus. Little desk. There's a fridge there. Little chair. And then this space, this actually is a drawer, but I didn't put anything in here. Um, and then this is the bathroom, honestly not the cleanest of bathrooms. And I tried to salvage these trousers by washing them in the shower, but they are well and truly ruined, so they're staying here. Um, but yeah, this is the bathroom. It's actually a really lovely hotel. Me and Lee were actually, sorry, I look like a hot mess. Me and Lee were actually discussing maybe coming back here in a couple of weeks time, just because it's my 21st birthday. And wow, why are we so zoomed in? It's my 21st birthday and um, we were gonna go to like London or Manchester, but we'll end up spending the same money as if we were to come here So may as well come back here because if you guys remember we did come to Malta for a video before And I feel like we just didn't do Malta properly because we only had 24 hours and obviously we didn't know what was in Malta But now I've come with some people that actually know what's around in Malta um, I feel like me and Lee can come here and have a good time. We can go see the Blue Lagoon. Hopefully the weather's a little bit warmer um, I've enjoyed it so much like the weather's been unbelievable. That's probably Lee right now um, the weather's been unbelievable like really hot i didn't expect it whatsoever actually a little bit burnt i've just been picking my head which i shouldn't have been but it's so addictive if any of you guys know when you burn on your head and it's like picky oh but yeah anyway i'm just wearing my party hard top home and my like zara shorts because they're comfy i'm gonna stick my party hard jumper on and my denim jacket because it's a little bit breezy today um but yeah everything's packed everything's ready i'm ready to go petrified because um i actually have to fly home on my own and for the whole week i've been really panicking about it because i didn't expect to be flying home on my own but has has kindly given me some rescue remedy um so i'm gonna try that i've also downloaded some things on netflix i'm gonna watch some things on netflix i'm terrified but I, the thought of getting me home is getting me through it. I'm not going to get home otherwise, so I've just have got to do it. Um, I'm kind of hoping I'm sat next to someone nice on the plane that I can talk to and hopefully they can reassure me. I am terrified of flying, like terrified, terrified, terrified. But yeah, I'm sad to be leaving. I've had the best time. I can't thank Party Hard enough for bringing me out here. It's been such an amazing opportunity. I'm so grateful. The guys at Party Hard are honestly some of the most amazing people I've ever met. They're so friendly. And I've made some amazing friends out here as well and met so many beautiful people. Hopefully I'll be able to make some more memories with them soon. Um, I know we all spoke about meeting up in Manchester sometime, but yeah, I've really, really enjoyed it. And I actually really enjoyed last night and I'm not a club in person, but I really, really, really enjoyed last night. Um, the clubs here are so amazing, like so much better than at home. Um, so yeah, if I ever need a good night out, I clearly just need to come to Malta. Like I said, a massive thank you to Party Hard if any of you guys are watching this. Um, yeah, I've had an incredible time and now it's time to go home. I'm sad, but I'm ready. I'm definitely ready. As you guys know, I was in Devon the week before this as well. So it's been a very busy couple of weeks. But yeah, get me on that plane. Well, actually, no, don't get me on. Oh, I don't know. I'm scared, but oh well. Bye, right, hands in. I'll get my shoes on. Oh, bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. Bye. That looks so rough. Oh, bye. <laughs> okay, everyone. I've just got to. Well, I've, I'm at the airport now. I'm talking a bit quiet because everyone will look at me weird if not. But I'm at the airport now and I have checked in, I've gone through security, I have come to my gate early, prep preparation. Um, I've got myself a Costa and I've got a, little, I got a hot chocolate and I got a muffin. I also bought myself a neck pillow. I'm feeling a little bit nervous but I've got you guys and that's all that matters. Thank you for understanding. It is future Ellie here. It has been actually quite a while since I went to Malta. I thought I would get all the craziness of my birthday out of the way and then I would give you guys a wonderfully chaotic Malta vlog, which I hope that you guys have enjoyed thoroughly. <laughs> I feel like this vlog has been the most up and down vlog 
ever but i really hope that you guys have enjoyed it if you have please smash a massive thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more vlogs like this um but yeah before i leave you guys i just wanted to say a massive 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 thank you to party hard for taking me to malta i honestly had the most amazing time i made so many incredible memories and met so many amazing people and made so many friends and i'm just so grateful for the opportunity honestly malta is the most beautiful place ever i don't know what me and lee were doing last time we went but we literally did not see half of the stuff i saw that leads me on to my next thing i just wanted to quickly mention that party hard's final release event packages are live now on their instagram i will pop it on the screen here so you can go check them out if you guys are thinking about doing a party holiday this year please check out party hard they will look after you they looked after me so well i was honestly so happy to have them around because it was my first party holiday and fair to say i was a little bit worried but i had the best time so definitely go and check them out and yeah a massive thank you to those guys for sending me over to malta and having the most amazing time and yeah thanks to you guys for watching and i will see you all in my next video bye guys